It's happening. Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu actually told Peter Obi some time ago that you know, if Peter Obi meets up with certain demand, he will have a debate with him. Before you could say Jack Robinson, but within 72 hours, one of the main thing there was that Peter Obi must bring out his manifesto. The manifesto is out, and guess what? Tinubu is out of the country. Ashiwaju, as we speak, is in the United Kingdom. He has not showed up, and before you could say Jack Robinson, his party released a message saying he will not be bullied or succumbed into any form of debate as he has other duties and other things he's engaged in. He will not participate in any debate. Peter Obi has told Nigerians, your very first point and first line of call. This is your first point and first line of call. This man has shown to you and everybody that he cannot be trusted. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Peter Obi met up with Ashiwaju and made Bola Tinubu's condition, but Tinubu never showed up for the debate. First line of call to Nigerians, be careful who you put in position because lies are all over the place. In an interview on, a, on AIT during the weekend program, the journalist said, that Mr. Peter Obi, the Labour Party presidential candidate, met with the conditions, but still Tinubu never showed up for the presidential town hall meeting. Peter Obi was given conditions by Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, as well as his party, the All Progressive Congress, that if he releases his manifesto and show what he has done in Anambra State, why he was the governor, Tinubu will gladly come for any form of meeting. Those very conditions have all been met, yet no show up. They never came for the town hall meeting. Arise TV got a report from APC and Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu that he will not be pressured or succumb to any form of debate and is presently out of the country. Now, this is a clear-cut condition for Nigerians to pay great attention and do not allow themselves to be deceived, manipulated, because manipulation is becoming the order of the day in the hands of those who are given fictitious promises but never really meant to keep them. These are very first points of call for everyone to see. A man a few weeks ago made mention that he will sincerely obey, follow, and come out for turn hall meeting if conditions are met. Conditions have been met and now he has, so he has absconded. So how do you feel, Nigerians, what gives you the assurance that such an individual will sincerely and truly fulfill any form of desire or words being said or given to you by such an individual? Can't you see that such an individual never meant to keep his words, only giving words and telling you what you feel you needed to hear and that's it nigerians must be careful because decision making time are critical and must not elude the fact that people can speak words are cheap but if you must get people who are honest you must look beyond those who are saying they want to do something and never really meant to do anything so Tinubu has just shown us who he truly really is. That's what he has just shown us. He has just come up to tell us and to give us his own, uh, you know, his own words. He has come to show to us who he truly is. Okay. So with Nigerians, we are watching and we are seeing and we are paying great attention at how these things are playing out. None of us should sit back there and think that all of a sudden things will fall in place. Anyone who wants to really make a real difference must ensure that they put not just their, you know, not just their hands to work, but in every way must, you know, ensure that they are doing all humanly speaking possible to bring Nigeria to the desired position. If things are going to change, if anything is going to get better, if the nation is going to move forward, it is high time. Okay, it is critical that we begin to put things in order for us to move forward. Yes, 
the people who are coming up to say we want to assist in such and such capacity, we want to do this, we want to do that. Have you vet these people? Have you gone ahead to ensure that what they are saying is true? Okay? This is why every one of us must ensure that we do not allow the same people over and over again. Most of them have no iota of concern for the nation. And what they do is quite different. What they are doing is quite different. They are only working out to see, you know, what they need, you know, what they can do, what will benefit them possibly. Yes? So if you are being told and you are being cautioned, okay, if you are being warned, you are being cautioned, you are being continuously, you know, told some things that needs to be done, you cannot overemphasize that point. You cannot think that all of a sudden things will fall in place. You must get on with it and you must ensure that, all, that everything is lining up nicely as it should be. Okay? So everyone and anyone who is standing there and thinking that, you know, things are all already settled, maybe you making a huge mistake. Okay? Maybe making a huge mistake. So everybody, every single one of us must see, must continuously see beyond the lens of greed, the possibility of making this nation a better place, not just for one, but for all. And at that very you know, very, very position, we can say, yes, this is what we've dreamt of. This is what we've envisaged. And the, 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 the heart, we must put our hearts to it. We must become very, very cognizant and very, you know, very, very focused on the fact that the things we see and the things we are, you know, we are having our minds on, you know, are honest, sincere, you know, words that must be put in order for Nigeria to become a better place for all. Remember, you have a you have what you have a voice, so you must speak out and do not allow the same thing over and over again. So at the end of the day, every one of us can be where we ought to be. Remember, it's up to you and I to bring about this change. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe, click on the notification buttons so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. Remember, we must make this difference together and we must make it work. Bye-bye.